Hi guys, this is Stephen Gogoi and today we're gonna to talk about Bank Nifty. Now you can see this is a Bank Nifty daily chart. First, let me show you uh, the two time frame like daily and weekly. Both are indicating differently and this is very uh, unique situation. Most of the people are doing big mistake. Uh, first, let me show you daily time frame. And the daily time frame, we have seen that the price is just running above the supporting level, right? So that means if you want to see previous market behavior, Bank Nifty was bounced from moving average 100. So this one 100 exponential moving average. Now we have seen the Bank Nifty is trying to bounce from this area same right uh, they are forming a supporting line here and uh, similarly they are forming a supporting line and another thing we can see here uh, bank nifty is rejecting multiple time here we have seen this is a rejection here was a rejection here was a rejection and above this supporting line or you can say this one moving average and we have seen this is a doji bar or some people are say like hammer pattern right so now after that we have seen another candle are there remember this is weekly i'm not talking right now uh, in daily so i'll i'll discuss about daily and now we have seen this is a strong momentum candle have you seen this one bullish momentum strong momentum right so when they are forming this type of candle, it is confirming that market will go up. But remember again, I am telling you, this is a weekly. So we have seen some supporting area are there. Here was support, support. And they are now forming a support are there. And the resistance, here we have seen this is a resistance zone, right? Sorry, this is the resistance zone because at that time the multiple rejection are there one twice third fourth right fifth time they are rejected and now you can see here they are rejecting are there so weekly if you wanna uh, like uh, invest for the long term invest sorry if you wanna enter for the long term investment or long positional trader of who people are option trader like a monthly basis right so they can go for by above this zone not now right when they are confirming this type of candlestick pattern market will go up and this is called multiple rejection candlestick pattern and this is a weekly weekly confirming as market will go up so but we have seen some entry point above this area we will start entry for the long position not a short position and then now uh it is daily so daily they are forming different candlestick pattern now at the level of 28200 uh there was a support uh, sorry resistance following by moving average 20 and here this was a support uh, uh, sorry resistance and a support uh, sorry resistance resistance and uh, now forming a resistance and big uh, uh, like uh, opportunity is showing here right now you can see this is a bullish candle after that yesterday this is a small candle and this call harami pattern or most of the people are using this is called inside bar both are same right so what is called inside bar so we have seen this is a small candle are there this is a inside bar followed by a large candle so that is called inside bar right this small candle called inside bar and uh, some people are say this is a uh, bearish harami pattern so if you don't have uh, idea about uh, bearish harami pattern you just visit to our ant iq page and go to pattern candlestick pattern you just click there and you will find many candlestick pattern are there and we need be this candlestick pattern and you just click read more now you can see uh, this is bearish candlestick pattern 
there is harami pattern you just uh, go through in this page and read their criteria signal inheritance and pattern behavior everything you will find here right now let's go to chart now you can see this is a daily chart time frame so now we have seen uh, in this area we never gonna take position but price is in a downtrend remember in a daily and a weekly in a uptrend and doing retracement weekly and the daily they are doing uh, running in a uptrend and doing retracement both are opposite same criteria but both are opposite uh, let me once again let uh, uh, let me explain daily so uh, this is a daily time frame and a daily time frame market is running in a downtrend and doing a retracement and the weekly running in a uptrend and doing a retracement right both are look like that so what is our trading uh, strategy today for the trading strategy uh, i can see here we uh, sorry uh, we will go for sell below this level of 27,593. So once they break, that means this is a candlestick pattern of forming. We have seen lower point are there. We will start selling below this area, not now. And remember, if they break this level, we will go for buy according to the weekly confirmation. So now we have seen one sell order are there and buy order are there but here is a big gap right almost uh, i think uh, thousand points are there so most of the people are thinking why i lose the thousand point is there any opportunity to enter in this market but question is that in which direction we will go for weekly showing uptrend and uh, doing retracement and the daily running in a downtrend and doing retracement now question is that in which direction we will go for buy we will follow weekly chart or we will follow daily so let's check it in a small time frame like a four hour so which a four hour look like that right so four hour we have seen this uh, inside bar there two inside bar are still running there and the following by moving average 20 right now so if you wanna uh, suppose if you wanna see some like uh, buy and the uh, above this level, not I'm talking right now uh, about the below. I'm talking about above. So once we'll see here buy opportunity, so we can go for buy, and we must close this position in this area above two eight uh, two zero right. So now we can see here uh, fifteen minutes for our trading. You can see. Now price is running like that, right? So I told, so now you can see price just uh, reached that area and retraced toward this 200 moving average and previous market behavior are there. Price was bouncing from moving average 200 and we have seen here. So they are supporting other. So we have seen a buy opportunity, but if you wanna buy in this area, you just place your asset just below this supporting level and you close your position in this area and trading ratio will be one is to one and always do money management right sl will be two seven five nine three so just below in this area and this is our sl and that will be our target right here our entry point suppose so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching